couch potatoes. All right, Welcome so... back to Lore with Jace. Yeah. Wait, was that the end of the episode, or did you start the timer? Or stop the timer for that? What? Is this the next episode? Yeah. Is... Okay, all right, I was confused. Last episode, I died because I put on the wrong ring. I tried to find the right ring, and I couldn't. So, anyway, over there where all those guys were, uh, they were just... That's like when you tried... What you just did is what you like when you try to get in the shed. You just start the shower and you think it's the right temperature. Yeah. And you get in, you put like your first leg in. And you're like, no, 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 no. no, 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 no and you no, get no. back out. And you just have like one leg dripping on the floor. And you're just like mm -hmm. standing there naked, confused, and in pain. I'm going to take some of this stuff off so I can run faster. Ew. Yeah, right? Ew. I'm a, I'm a zombie. Oh, God. Ew. Yeah. All right, so that item up in the distance is just a... Em, like a chaos ember, ember of chaos, whatever. It allows you to upgrade your swords to the chaos, whatever. Is this making sense? Uh, let me know if if this is going to fast. Ladies and gentlemen, Jace, the Dark Souls master. Um, but anyway, I don't really need it, so I'm not going to get it. But what you need is like the charred base ring, orange charred ring, something you get from beating ceaseless discharge. I must have. Fed it His the... name was Ceaseless Discharge? Yes, we made... Please tell me I made a joke about that yes, before. Yes, you did. Trust okay, me. Okay, good. You made... You milked it for all it was worth, Jamie. Be <laughs> proud of yourself. There's an item right over there to the left. Is that the ring? No. Are you sure? I'm positive. That's I probably... Like you beat him and just didn't pick it up. It's probably just souls or something. All right, so uh, back, back to the lore. Whatever. All right, so got this flame, right? Flame turns on, humans, life, they beat the dragons, we're on top of the world. Right. The flame is naturally supposed to go out. It's mm -hmm. supposed to die. Okay. But, you know, big man Zeus, I cannot f remember his name for the life of me. Um, but anyway, the main god that is the final boss was like, no, that's stupid, I like living. So he went down to where the first flame was, and he is now using his life force to keep it alive, making humans the, you know, the big shit still. Um, and this guy. what the witches did, we beat him oh, once. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's, that was a boss once. Yeah. What the witches did was they were like, hey, we are going to artificially create... He was way bigger as a boss, though. Yeah. He's like, we are going to artificially create a new flame to, you know... And they created chaos energy. And uh, that's where the demons yeah, come from. Because, like, humans are born from the first flame. Demons are born from the bed of chaos, which is the boss. Um, hmm. And that's the reason that there's the curse of the undead is because, you know, the age of humanity is supposed to end, but it can't because the god is keeping the fire lit. That makes sense. So people can't die. They just come back as soulless husks. That makes sense. Huh. I'm glad you think so, because it can get confusing. It was confusing before when you were explaining it wrong, <laughs> but now that you corrected it, yeah. it all makes sense to me. Well, I'm glad what? that I could explain it in a... Because there are some YouTubers who... Uh, <laughs> look at them. <laughs> Those guys in the back are like, don't talk to me or my son ever again. <laughs> yeah. did, he just, did he just show up and fucking kill that guy? What kind of neighborhood do we live in? This place is the best school system <laughs> in the public, Sprite State Public area. transportation, you know, fair water tax. Oh, three of them, great. Yeah, um, but I think only one will attack. Yeah. Two of them at the most. Anyway, so, uh... Yeah, they have YouTubers who, like, go really deep into the lore, and they have notes, and they have, uh... You know, all this stuff set up, and I'm just, like, I'm here with a controller in my hand, and that's it. Yeah. So you guys at home are going to have to forgive me if uh, if I miss something or I explain something incorrectly, because I am not keeping tabs on this. I'm kind of just opening my mouth, <laughs> moving the jaw, and exhaling. Well, I mean, to be fair, it's one of those games that doesn't really tell you lore. Well, and... Which you I'm all... not really a huge fan of, usually, unless it's done right. See this? I don't like it when it's too big. Yeah. When there's this much going on, and we just played through this whole game, and I had no idea why. Yeah. You know what I mean? Until just now. Jeez, this is getting really laggy. Never mind. It is. It's getting framey. Oh, there's um, stairs right there. Yeah. Yeah. 
Until just was, now. I was going to get down all there. Kinds of games like, like, I hate to bring it up. I never played them, but I've watched people play them. Five Nights at Freddy's yeah. is, uh, is like that. Where it doesn't tell you any kind of... But then again... That was never meant to have story like this. Right, the bite kind of, of made by the fans. or whatever. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah, hold on. All right. Yes. Yeah, so sorry about the pause. So lore, right? Yeah, I don't Five know. Nights if you can Freddy's. have a large and open environment like this and still tell a story just through storytelling. You know what I mean? Like. Yeah. Legend of Zelda does it all the time. Anyway, Legend of Zelda does it all the time. Like, you have large, open... I, I'd say this is like an adult Legend of Zelda. Am I wrong saying that? Uh, Am I incorrect no. saying that? I, I, I think, you know, it's definitely got the same kind of feel. So why no, then? No, I'm saying no, it's not incorrect for oh, you to oh, say. Oh, okay. It. I'm sorry. The um, only difference is you don't ever talk to any characters. There's no character progression because oh, yeah. there's no other characters. This is a worst case scenario, Legend of Zelda. Yeah, and I think that's kind of... I don't know if 2 and... No, I'm going to go ahead and assume 2 and 3 are the same way because I watched Bloodborne playthroughs and it's the same thing. Yeah. No one tells you anything except for where to go for the next boss and who they are. Really, most of the lore that you get is through descriptions of items. I see, I hate that. Armor, like... That I mean that <laughs> that was anticlimactic. Yeah. That that's really about it. Uh, Cause they have some characters you talk to, but they only give you very limited amount of information, and sometimes it's wrong. Yeah. Just because like they're written as human character. Well, characters who can make mistakes. Yeah. And characters who don't know. They're written as characters in the game who are trying to figure out the lore on their yeah. own. <laughs> Fuck you too, buddy. So Jesus they know just Christ. as much as we do at the time, which is... I mean, it's cool, don't get me wrong, but when None... there's so much, it's flawed. Mm-hmm. Oh, definitely. I suppose, is the way to is the way to put it. Why were we talking about it? Um, <laughs> just because I was going on about lore and oh, saying yeah. that how sometimes I make mistakes because I don't have everything in front of me. Right. Oh, oh boy. Why does this guy look bigger? I thought I was gonna die there. Um, I don't know. I was also gonna. I was also saying that because, like, in Dark Souls Three, from what I've seen of like the the pre-build footage of all that and all that, all that, all that, all that. Mm -hmm. I just said all that a bunch yeah. for no reason. Um, all that. Like someone said in one of the plays I was watching that Dark Souls Three is supposed to be like a prequel. Um, but I have no idea. Like, how would you even know that? I like, don't. Yeah, I don't know that that's true. Because Dark Souls 3 isn't about... Dark Souls 3 isn't about the undead curse. Dark Souls 3 is about the Lords of Cinder, which from what I understand... Someone said it had more to do with the dragons. And because of that, it was implied that it took place before all of this when the dragons were still around, or something like that, and more prominent. Because Maybe. you go to all the same places. Yeah. Except none of, they're not torn to shit. And they also have some returning characters, like the blacksmith. Yeah. Um, they have one of the witches from Dark Souls 2. Oh, yeah. Oh. Thought I was going to run right into you, didn't you, buddy? <laughs> and these places and characters aren't all torn to shit. So everyone's yeah. like, oh, Dark Souls 3 is a prequel. But I mean, like, I don't even... I don't even know anything. I don't know. World building is tough in video games. It is. I'll say that. World building is tough no matter, like, if it's a book, a video game, whatever. Well, it's easier in books because you can... Holy oh, great. Shit, you've been surrounded. I'm just gonna excuse me, sir. Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> Weapon at risk. Great. Again? And I didn't even get any repair powder. Amateur hour over yeah, here. Yeah, right. And I swear to God, I can't see the chain if this is a mimic. Okay, good. <laughs> Goes one way to find out, I suppose. Large Ooh, flame ember. So I don't know what that does. That allows me to. Uh, well, that's death down there. Um, that just allows me to upgrade my flame weapons past 5 into plus 10. Oh, neat. Do you have flame weapons? Oh, jeez. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. Last I checked, your Zwei-hander is a lightning, isn't it? Yeah, Zwei-hander's lightning. Um, I like it. It's not going to be very useful against the final boss, just because the final boss is a lightning guy. Great. Um, Can we use the dragon sword? Yeah. 
Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. You're so excited. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, it seems... Should you upgrade this stuff, too? I, you can't upgrade boss armor. Makes sense. But, Makes um... Makes sense. But, yeah, so, I mean... What are those things? Those, those fat, pig, gross those things. Those pig statues? Are they pigs? They're demon statues, but some of them are alive, some of them aren't. They're like gargoyles. They're disgusting. Oh, yeah, they're gonna... They're, you're gonna see a lot of them. Is the boss through that door? I think they're supposed to be like tiny asylum demons. Oh, the guy in the beginning. Yeah. By the way, uh huh. I remember one of the things I said was he reminds me of something from somewhere, from World of the Asylum. Do you remember we were yeah. fighting him? Like he reminds me of something else. He does remind me of something from World of Warcraft. It's like one of the big demon bosses mm -hmm. from one of like it from the Legion. I don't want to say this and be wrong. Man, I, I don't have his, no idea what you're talking I, about. I have a people might. He reminds me of one of the bosses, one of the demons. There's the four-legged demons. Um, God, I wish I could remember the specific one's name. That gave Gromash the fucking you're potion just, of death. You're just putting words together right now. And this is how this feels. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just so you know. Because World of Warcraft in me, I didn't really care for it. Um, mostly because I didn't try it. Before this episode ends, uh -huh. I'm going to go a little bit long. I'm going to look it up. I'm going to find out. All right. Find out his name. Let's see. Four-legged um, demon. Wow. <laughs> Four-legged uh, demon. Wow, huh? Come on. Give me the specific one. Give me the specific one, you son of a bitch. No, 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 no. All right, I gotta put in real acronyms. Oh, come on. Mm -hmm. Well, while Jamie's doing that, I'm just going to explain to the people at home what Stop I am doing. doing. So, um, you, you guys noticed I didn't go through the fog door because there's a boss there, and uh, it's just going to take too much time at the moment to... Uh, to settle all that, so I'm kind of going off the beaten path. You've got these sunlight bugs uh, right here, which uh, you're going to see come into play later when we have to face a familiar, a uh, familiar friend who will become a familiar foe because I chose not to. Um, all right, screw it. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, I'll find it later. All right. Next. <laughs> So matter of fact, are you sure? Yeah, done. All right. Whatever you were saying, care is done. Bye. Don't touch that door. All right, bye.